we're going to be comparing the battle royale map blackout from both call of duty mobile and call of duty black ops 4 so let's begin as you would expect both games include the same version of the map featuring 16 main locations some of the more popular locations including nuketown island hijacked firing range and raid looking at both games side by side call of duty mobile graphics wise didn't look all that bad in comparison to black ops 4 now you need to keep in mind that the blackout map on black ops 4 takes up an estimated 10 to 15 gigabytes of storage while on cod mobile it only takes up 495 megabytes a very significant difference however when walking through some of the more open areas around the map you can begin to see the size limitations take effect on on cod mobile we see much fewer trees and overall greenery in comparison to black ops 4 we can assume that cod mobile had to sacrifice the level of detail in order to keep the storage size of the map reasonable and even then it's still pretty impressive how the map turned out to be on cod mobile now the map is cool and all but what about the water reflections you would think that cod mobile would have some pretty terrible water reflections in comparison to black ops 4 but surprisingly enough they both seem to be evenly matched when it comes down to the swimming animations both are virtually the same however when it comes to swimming underwater you can tell right away there is a lot more attention to detail in black ops 4 in comparison to the flat and empty underwater atmosphere inside of cod mobile one interesting thing that i found however on call of duty mobile water actually reflected objects that were nearby such as trees while on black ops 4 it didn't really Really reflect anything at least not that clearly in black ops 4 there's a total of 33 weapons available for use while in cod mobile there's 68 weapons over double the amount but surprisingly enough between both games there's only five weapons that are found in common the mx9 gks and the cordite for the smg category we also have the hades lmg and lastly the outlaw when it comes to the health system of black ops 4 you are given 150 HP to start out. However, if you take any damage, you'll need to find the various different healing items scattered around the map in order to regenerate your health back to 150 or a max of 200. Additionally, there is three different levels of armor vests that you can find as well, which will help reduce the amount of damage that you take. In COD Mobile, you're given only 100 HP. However, instead of having armor vests, there's different levels of armor shields that can increase your total HP to a max of 300. There's no actual healing items such as med kits or bandages since your HP will automatically regenerate after a couple of seconds. Between COD Mobile and Black Ops 4, both games share five of the same vehicles. The ATV, muscle car, cargo truck, tank, and the helicopter. Additionally, there is the ARAV, which is very similar to the Antelope A20 found in COD Mobile. Both games also feature a water vehicle as well, the tactical raft, and the speedboat. There's also one more vehicle found in Black Ops 4 that is not included in COD Mobile, which is no other than the SUV. However, in return, COD Mobile has the rally car, ORV, and the motorcycle for use in the game. Also, another interesting feature that COD Mobile has, you can actually drive in first person inside of the muscle car, which is something that you cannot do with any vehicle at all in Black Ops 4. Call of Duty Mobile had to sacrifice a lot of the visual aspects of the map in order to keep the storage size reasonably low. But in addition to that, an entire section of the map was completely removed. Going over to Ghost Town in Black Ops 4, there is an entire underground section with abandoned buildings that you could loot but in call of duty mobile it was completely wiped out also if you were to head over to asylum on black ops 4 there would be a horde of zombies that would spawn and try to hunt you down but in call of duty mobile these zombies are nowhere to be found i understand why cod mobile did this but it's still unfortunate to see these features cut from the map that's going to do it for the comparison video thanks for watching and subscribe.